I have been watching. Since I was a child, hidden among these rocky cliffs, I've watched the rifts between my people grow. Slowly, gradually. Like the way the canyon widens, rock by rock, falling to the mighty Karth year after year. But where the river sustains us, these fractures do not. I have seen our briar-hearted warriors grow arrogant with power. I have seen our revered ags at each other's throats over which of their champions should lead us. I've seen the raids, the shattered serenity, the bloodshed, and the death. I have seen what the Bear of Markarth turned us into. But this is not who we are. From this perch above our tower, I watch the peaceful village just below us. A mining town. Sometimes I hear faint laughter on the breeze. The bell-torn strike of pickaxes and the hissing of the smelter. It is not quiet, that village. But the sounds are not the shouting of arguing leaders or the clash of weapons. The man who runs that town has no fear of raiding, for he is one of ours. This is who we are. The children of Karth and Druidach. Harsh is the land that birthed us. But this does not mean we should not know peace. This does not mean we need to destroy each other. We are warriors, farmers, hunters, crafters, witches. We are the children of magic and stone and bone. We are the children of the spirits of the rich. And the spirit of Fuelan rages in our hearts, lashing out without direction. I've grown tired of watching. I've grown tired of seeing what peace we could have if we all moved with a purpose. The time has come to draw the arrow. After all, what is a bear to a hunter?